Sometimes you'll see the degree measure of an angle written like this. This says 12 degrees, and then there's an 18 with looks like a slash or an apostrophe beside it. In some contexts, this symbol means feet, if you're measuring the length of something. But here, that slash actually stands for minutes. This would be read aloud, 12 degrees, 18 minutes. And a minute is a fraction of a degree. It's less than a single degree. It's a 60th of a degree. 18 minutes is actually 18 60ths of a single degree. So 12 degrees, 18 minutes is actually the same thing as 12 degrees plus that fraction, 18 60ths of a degree. If I wanted to write 12 degrees and 18 minutes as a decimal, I could perform this addition. Maybe first re, uh, put 18 over 60 in lowest terms, which is 3 tenths. And 3 tenths as a decimal would be 0 0.3. So 12 degrees plus 3 tenths, 0 0.3 degrees is simply 12.3 degrees. 12 degrees, 18 minutes is exactly the same as 12.3 degrees. It's just two different ways to represent the same number of degrees. If I would want to represent this as a fraction, I could simply say, hey, this 12 degrees plus 3 tenths of, of a degree is, as a mixed number, 12 and 3 tenths of a degree. Or another way to state that as an improper fraction would be to say, this is 123 tenths of a degree. So I actually have on the screen right now four different ways to represent the same degree measure. 12 degrees, 18 minutes, 12.3 degrees, 12 and 3 tenths degrees, and 123 tenths degrees. Let's take this a step further. What I have on the screen now says 25 degrees, and as we now know, the next part is 20 minutes, and this last part is 6 seconds. This is read aloud 25 degrees, 20 minutes, and 6 seconds. We know that 20 minutes is, a, is 20 sixtieths of a degree. Well, 6 seconds is 6 sixtieths of a minute. So if I would want to convert 25 degrees, 20 minutes, 6 seconds to decimal form, what I would have to do is the following addition. 25 degrees and then 20 minutes is uh, 20 sixtieths of a degree. And this last part says six over 3,600. Where did this 3,600 come from? Well, a minute is a 60th of a degree and a second is a 60th of a minute. So a second is actually, uh, because it is a 60th of a minute, which is a 60th of a degree, to write minutes as a single fraction in the unit of degrees, I have to multiply 60 times 60. That's where the 3600 comes from, 60 times 60. Six seconds is a 60th of a minute, which is a 60th of a degree. Simplifying this a little bit, 20 over 60 is one over three degrees and six over 3,600 is one six hundredth of a degree. The sum, 25 degrees plus a third of a degree, which is what 20 minutes is, plus one six hundredth of a degree, which is what six seconds is, is 25.335 degrees. 25 degrees, 20 minutes, six seconds in decimal form, is 25.335 degrees.